Hello, welcome to this short video on where I'm going to tell you where Ansible playbooks are stored. So by default, when you install Ansible, um, it goes into a folder called slash etc slash Ansible. So I'm on a Linux, Linux uh, Ubuntu 20.04 machine here, and I'm in the Ansible folder. So if I do a present working directory, that's the folder that Ansible is installed in, slash etc slash Ansible. And in there, we have the Ansible config and the host file. Now, this is where people who start out using Ansible would normally store their playbooks. So you can either write the playbook directly into that folder. Um, some people actually create a folder in here, and they'll call it playbooks. like this and now in there I've got a folder called playbooks where I would write my playbooks now this is great if you're just on your own machine and you're just running Ansible uh, just for your own use if you're also going to be working on other projects then what I would advise is that you create a separate folder for each Ansible project that you use so if we go over to my uh, my network programmability folder, so this is where I keep everything, and I've got a an Ansible folder in here. Um, I'm also uh, working on some Batfish stuff, some Nornia stuff. So I keep it all in one place. Um, there is this is a public Git repo, so I I'll pop a link to that in the description of the video. So if you want to pull the whole lot, have a look. You know, you're more than welcome. Um, the Ansible folder so i actually have a playbook here which i'll walk you through which um, sets up myself and my machine for a new project so we've got a little playbook here called new project and what this does is basically prompts me for the name of the project and it creates a few folders and copies the ansible config and a sample host file over to that place and then We'll go into that and I'll show you then where I would save my playbooks. So let's just get into my, so this is in my home directory, this, this whole lot lives. Here's the network programmability folder. And then I'll go into my scripts folder. Okay, so I'm going to run the new project dot yaml. Oh, sorry, Ansible playbook new project dot yaml. So this now prompts me for the name of my project or customer. So if we call this, um, for example, project six. And I'll run through what this is actually doing in a second. So let's jump into that folder and we'll see where it is. So go to the folder. Now it's created it in my, my home directory. And this is all you know, specific for me. But it, what it does do is it keeps everything completely separate so here's my home directory down here and you can see now i've got a folder that's called project six now in the folder project six we've copied in uh, a sample group vars file we've copied in a sample ansible config file and a sample host file so this is the project so this is where i would save my ansible playbooks so if i'm starting this project now for you know, this customer this would normally be the customer name and then I would go in here and let's create a new file in there and we call this one playbook one so that's now where my playbooks are, are saved so I would save the playbooks for this project in the own specific folder for that project so in answer to the question where are ansible playbooks stored 
um, the answer is you can actually store your Ansible playbook wherever you want, um, as long as it's on the machine. And then you need to specify from where you run that playbook um, where the ansible.config file and the host file uh, are, so you know where to reference them. By default, the Ansible config and the host file that are in the slash etc slash Ansible folder is where Ansible will look first. And then if you've specified some other ones, the, the way that Ansible works, so within this folder, this project six folder, if we write our playbook in here and we run it, the first thing it will do is it will look within the folder for an ansible.cfg file. If it doesn't find one, then it will start looking in other places and end up in the default location. But if we put an ansible.cfg file in the project folder, and then within that Ansible CFG file, we've specified where the host file is. So we've said that also lives locally in the same folder and a couple other things. And then I will put all my playbooks within the same folder. And the main reason for this is it keeps everything tidy. I've got a separate host file for this project. I've got all the playbooks for this project and it's, it's separate. I can move the entire folder somewhere else and carry on. And um, that's my personal opinion. Um, it's also a very good practice um, because otherwise what happens is you'll end up with hundreds and hundreds of Ansible playbooks in the default location um, and there's no way to sort of keep them together in an ordered manner. So if you were looking for the answer to where to store Ansible playbooks, I uh, hope this has answered the question. Um, if you want to know more, uh, my name is Roger Perkin. I am a CCIE 50038. I'm a network consultant. I'm based in the UK. Um, I also do a lot more videos on Ansible and Python and Nornia and all the network automation topics. Um, so if you check out my website, there's a link in the description. It's just rogerperkin.co.uk. And I've also got some courses on Ansible for network engineers and some Python ones and one coming on Git shortly. Um, so please, yeah, any questions, please drop them in the comments of the video and I'll look forward to seeing you in the next one. Thank you.